Good. Now, fill me in, how familiar is Viceroy with FOE or with Greninja in general? Um, I'm not sure how familiar, because, you know, I've been out of the tournaments recently when okay. Viceroy has been on his up and up. But I, re I remember um, back uh, when they when we, this this tournament series was in Manassas, mm -hmm. um, they played each other quite a bit. Okay. Um, this was before FOE's uh, Greninja became, like, his main character. Okay. So I'm not sure if he's that familiar with FOE's Greninja. Because, I mean, that's the really the unique thing about Greninja. You might maybe fight one in bracket. Mm -hmm. You're not going to have that experience. Whereas today we have, there's like three or four at least. Three or four Greninjas, but we have like nine Rosalinas. I know. There we have so many. And I mean, Rosalina is not a super common character in her own right. Mm -hmm. But Greninja, you just kind of look at and say, well, what do I do? Mm -hmm. I was playing one earlier today in friendlies, and I would get hits off. But I was like, how do I how do I combo this character? He's he's yeah. light. He's quick. I can't I can't put hands on him. Mm -hmm. So you don't you uh, you obviously I'm assuming you mean Rosalina because of your name. Yes, that, but that's correct. <laughs> so do, have you ever uh, faced this in a tournament uh, setting? Up faced uh, a good Greninja? I have. There mm -hmm. is arts. I believe he's now eight on our PR. We have Don Quavius, who's a very very strong Greninja in mm -hmm. NC. And uh, that went very poorly. He kind of he kind of did me in. Was it was it more of do you think the matchups bad or do you just not know how to play against Greninja? It was a definite combination of the two. Like Bruce, yeah. Bruce had my number. Obviously, he's a much better player than I am. Mm -hmm. But I had no idea what to get do with Greninja. I know about a midweight character, uh, super great speed, terrible grab, not great out of shield options. So I mean, there's ways to get punishes, but it's not super easy to do. Vice are doing the smart thing now, just grabbing these uh, these water shurikens though, and I like the platform cancel there, getting lane without the without falling all the way down. I do like um, Greninja dash attack to kill Luma really early. Yeah, absolutely. Um, it, but I'm I'm not sure if he has any other really good kill moves on Luma. Um, Vice are doing a fantastic job of just playing patient right now. That's a key thing to do. You don't want to overextend against Ooh, Greninja. He messed and up there. Yeah, FOE did not want that downer. If he, and he, if he did want that downer, he, I think he wanted to go off the stage so that he could double jump back up um, if the move ended. I'm not sure exactly how And, and how instead, that obviously, as we saw, landing with it and all the lag that comes with it. So much lag. Ooh, is 18%, he gonna be risky? 18%, 18%. He's going to see it come off again? No, he's gonna, missed the dare. A vice where had a great opportunity for a serious edge guard. I think um, edge guarding Rosalina shouldn't be uh, that hard for Greninja, but I Viceroy is just really good at like mixing up his recovery and making it back. So Greninja really going to have two main ways to do it. You're going to see as he already opted for the Hydro Pump, which is going to be very useful. Mm -hmm. But he can also run off and bear a really strong situation because a lot of Rosalinas, their mix-up will include them hugging the stage to avoid that water shuriken. Yeah. And the uh, the backer is a great counter action for that. I did like that he... um. Uh, uh, fell down from ledge and then did a uh, double jump up air to stop Luma's uh, jabs so he could come back and make a jab combo of his own on Rosalina. Yeah, against a lot of characters, that jab on the ledge there is just such a suffocating tool. Ooh, I'm surprised boy, you didn't die. Thank you, Battlefield. <laughs> on, like, any other stage, that would have been instant death. Um, and that's really the terrifying thing about Rosalina, man. Like, he was, he was oh, no up smash there, unfortunately. Oh, uh... I'm pretty sure uh, Greninja's counter is really, really good against Luma. It kills really, really early, but um, it wasn't the right move in that choice. Uh, no, Viceroy just waited it out. Definitely baited out by Viceroy. But super close, only 10% separating the players. Viceroy obviously very well aware of the fact that he needs to jump away in that scenario, or else he's going to get caught in that up smash. Hmm. I think, uh, ooh. He must, he must have seen that coming with the Shadow, shadow on yeah. the ground. Shadow sneaks and gets rid of Luma, catches the up smash, but no Luma like we mentioned, no will he, KO. Will he make, will he not punish it? It doesn't look like he's gonna like punish the uh, missing of, or the, the Luma death. Uh, he wasn't able to, to capitalize. Ooh, using the Nair to cut through Shadow Snake. Dead frog. He waited, he waited. Let me tell you, I love that option, and I love seeing Vicegrove that a lot of Rosalinas will remain, maintain stage control, which is obviously very, very smart. Rosa is suffocating on stage, but that down air is unbelievably strong. I, I remember once I died at like 70% on the edge of like town and city with that, and I'm like, how does this move the, kill? The worst, I, the worst I ever did at anybody was a Meta Knight at 40. Like, and it's just, just that feeling of I, I'm, I'm physically sorry. <laughs> this is this is my fault. I did this to you. I I don't know what to say, man. You know, you're just it's not your fault. You didn't you didn't play bad. It's just 
this, this character, man. This character's <laughs> a little silly. A little, a little silly. Okay, so going in, he's uh, went Ooh. back to Battlefield. He's power shields by both players there. I thought he was going to get punished with that Dax on shield. I think uh, going back to Battlefield might have been the best choice. I'm not sure what other stages would be better. I think FD might have been better, but uh, Vice would probably banned it. Well, the unique um, thing about this matchup is the fact that both characters are going to opt for a lot of that off-the-top kills. Yep. And I just I just feel like FOE knows that he shouldn't give a Rosalina a low ceiling. Like, yeah. Reninja benefits for it from it, sure, but I don't think any character really benefits as much as Rosalina does. Like, Greninja kills super early off the top with that, like, double jump up air kill. But at the same time, uh, it it's not nearly as quick as Luma up, up air. Like, it's not nearly as quick, and it's much harder to confirm, too. Mm -hmm. Like, at low percents, like, if Viceroy manages to close out this stock and have a decent amount of rage, he's going to be killing off that top platform with an up throw up air, which is confirmed, by the way, for the viewers at home at low percents. It's going to be, like, it's going to be 30, 40, 50 percent just, just dead, dead in the water. Character silly. <laughs> so I really like Viceroy using the Nair. That's a tool that I. Re oh my God! I'm s sorry. Yep, that. So <laughs> sorry, headphone viewers. Got the down air spike, down air stage spike. But uh, yeah, the neutral air is a really great tool. Um, it's a great spacing option against uh, characters that don't really have a lot of range to them. And it's actually uh, zero on shield, so it's just, you're able to throw it out and go for a down tilt, a grab, a rapid jab, a smash attack. You know, whatever floats your boat. So many options. Ooh, that was a good short shuriken tech. Yep. And we saw the backer that I mentioned, but Viceroy was ready. You know, and it's it's a multi it's a multi hit Drew Ninja's backer, so it's gonna make it a little bit more difficult to tech it as well. But Viceroy right wisely avoids it. Ooh, that was Shadow Sneak, but I'm sending surprised him that, that didn't kill. That 45 degree angle was really the issue. He was trying to go for the um the uppy the hydro pump. And wasn't able to make it. I really like that um that falling neutral air. Yeah, the lunar the land. Room. Yep. Ro what? Luma. Luma is Luma. so dumb. <laughs> How I love you, Luma. <laughs> you are silly. All right. Yep. Just get the jab combo to get rid of. Ooh, what? sharks all the way in. That just makes me mad, man. Like, <laughs> like I I like sharking with up air. That was deeper than I even would have gone. Oh. Uh oh. Yep. Oh. No, he's gonna make it's that too back. Too far away. He should have had something to wait, and unfortunately does not. And 132%. Like, FOE is in a real danger of dying right now. I don't think he's going to get the confirmed up there, up there, but he can bait out an air dodge. And we see that Nair again, like I was talking about. It's such a great tool in neutral. And it's, it's I mean, you can, you can uh, perfect shield it and punish it, but FOE just not really ready for it. Right now, um, FOE... I don't. There are no confirms for Ninja has. I think he has to just go for yeah, the up. That is actually the, the Luma one killed him. He didn't even hit him with Rosa. You didn't hear the sound confirm from the floor. That is from the floor. It's seventy. This character's dumb. That is the God. Dumbest I love. I love Rosa so much. Ever seen? Gosh, Rosa's perfectly fine. Please no nerf Sakurai. Please I love her nerf so much. Sakurai. Rosa, like. Rosalina <laughs> is personally writing a letter to Sakurai 